Hi, welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to code a Ford Transit key or any blue Ford key for free. All you need to have is a laptop. I'll show you what you've got to do and also you need one of these. This is the one I use to connect it to your laptop into your OBD port. I think this was about five quid on eBay, one of these. Very, very cheap. But what you need to do first is download some software for free. It's Forescan. I'll put a link in the bottom. Download that for free onto your laptop. And you get, when you download it first time, you have, you can download a license for free for two months. And you get three of those. So when that one runs out, you can renew it. Another free one and another free one. But then I think it's not a lot of money to, if you do a lot of this sort of stuff. Um, it works for Fords and Mazdas. Okay, let me just get it up and I'll show you what you've got to do. Right, so you just plug it into the OBD port there. Plug the other side into your laptop. And here it is. This is the four scan. Right, so when it's all connected, you're going to click log and log the vehicle in. These ones down here, you would just click that one to connect the vehicle to your laptop. And you would, then you would just select the profile of whatever one you've got. All right, so when you've selected it, just click on the spanner one over here. And then it's going to come up with all the modules you've got. You want the Pats programming one here. So when you've selected it, click the little play button here. And then just follow the instructions, it's very simple. As you can see, mine says I've got six keys stored on this. I've only ever key uh, I've, I've only ever done two. So there's some other keys somewhere. And you can just click uh, ignition key programming, which is what you want. Click OK. And just follow the instructions, continue anyway. And it tells you what you've got to do. You've got to complete the task in 10 seconds. So you've got to switch your ignition off, insert your new key. I've only got one key. So what I did was take the blue, the blue fob off and put my new blue fob on and put the ignition back on. Then you click OK and then it just does it automatically. Then you've keyed, um, you've coded two keys in. Um, I got my blue fob from the scrapyard. When I was up there, I bought some bits and uh, that was in the bag with the other bits and so yeah that's all you got to do very very simple good software this is you can code injectors and all sorts of stuff so it does you all the uh, error codes and all sorts of things okay well i hope this has helped some of you out and uh, thanks for watching